Before this video begins, I just want to say a huge thank you to all of you in the Bell Squad. Recently, the support on the channel and the support from you guys that have hit the bell has been crazy. I'm so thankful and I hope to continue to bring you guys amazing Destiny 2 videos for as long as I can or as long as you guys will watch me. And now, let's move on to today's video. What is going on you guys? Welcome back. This is Mike or Geekermon. It has been a little while as you can tell from the beard here since I have filmed a Destiny 2 video. Just got back from the beach but I'm super excited to hop back into the crucible and hopefully hit another crispy we ran out of metals so in today's video we're going to be using the huckleberry which is one of the new exotic smgs i still have not gotten this thing to drop but i've gotten a ton of requests for it so we hopped on my buddy devin's account huge shout out to him thank you so much for letting me use your account and so we're gonna hop on here use the huckleberry and uh hopefully just destroy everybody with the smg all right so let's take a look at what we're rocking today so we have the huckleberry now oh he also has the devil's work on it wow all right, so the Huckleberry's exotic intrinsic perk is increased rate of fire and recoil while you're holding down the trigger. Kills with this weapon reload a portion of the magazine. Now we also have kills with this weapon temporarily grant increased damage and we are rocking top tree arc strider. So melee kills are gonna trigger health regen. And then we're also rocking marksman's dodge, which can reload our weapon. I feel like if we're able to use this gun properly, we should be able to mow through people at close range. Now I've also put on some other weapons that I don't have on my account because I thought it would be fun to try to test these out while we can. So I have on the Darkest Before, which is one of the uh, Trials Pulse Rifles. So yeah, with the Masterwork for extra handling, I'm pretty sure this gun is going to be a monster in the Crucible. And then last but not least, a sniper I still don't have, Alone as a God, with Snapshot, Triple Tap, Ambitious Assassin. This thing, how cool looking is this sniper rifle right here? I have never gotten to use it before. So in today's video, this is going to be our very first time using this sniper. We have 10 mobility on. I'm not going to bother messing with his armor loadout. I think what he has on looks pretty solid so far. We also have the frosties, which I just got recently, but it's increased grenade, increased melee, and dodge while you're sprinting. Dodging increases your sprint speed. So that should actually pair super well with what we're trying to do with this huckleberry here. So I think that's it. Pretty simple. Let's hop into the crucible and see if we can't hit a we ran out of metals. Well, that was pretty easy. There we go. We got that guy down. I think there's a hammer back there somewhere, though. Should I even go this way? Probably not. Oh, get out of there. Just go. Just go. Dodge. Dodge. All right, pull out the sniper and turn around. Here we go. Brace yourself. Come on. I tried. I hit him right in the neck. We did hardly any damage to that guy. All right, time to bust out the huckleberry. Let's see how it goes right here. There's guys on all three sides of us. This guy's not looking, though. Jump up, Mike. Oh, my goodness. Please. Please. All right, we got one down. Where are they at? All right, let's push right around this corner. There's a guy in here. Sneak up on him. He won't be ready for it. He won't be ready for it. There we go. Nicely done. We got a little help from the super, but that's fine. We are down 18 to 50 right now. We've got to step it up. Let's go. There we go. Got the health regen procking too. Nicely done. They're going to come for zone B. We are going to stop them right here. Nice try, golden gun. I don't think so. <laughs> All right, there's another guy right around this corner here. Let's dodge through here and get him. There we go. The comeback is real. See if we can make a huge comeback here. Much needed. We are way, way down. All right, did I reload everything? Are we good? I shouldn't be in the air with the huckleberry, I feel like. Oh, my. Let's lob the nade back there and try to pulse rifle him. That pulse rifle actually did a lot of damage there. I'm impressed. I like the reload animation for the Huckleberry, too. It's got a really cool reload animation. Oh, their whole team is right here. Back up, Mike, back up. Okay, all right, we're fine. Maybe they'll push up towards me. There we go. I might burn out, though. If I can stay alive, we'll be okay. Come on, come on, come on. We got him, but it took too long. All right, we got five bullets in the sniper. Here we go, down the hall. I know he's back there. Is he still on the radar? Yep. There we go. This sniper feels really crisp. I have not used this sniper before, but I really like it so far. All right, we got to be aggressive here. Oh, snap. Are they going to peek me again? Is he going to peek it? All right, let's push up here and be aggressive. Oh, the flinch is so real right now. I missed it. I missed it. It's over. It's over. Nice work, teammates. Appreciate you guys keeping me alive. I missed that no scope, but thanks to you, it's okay. 
All right, if they capture zone C, I could push across here. All right, it's time to make an aggressive push to zone B. I know they're back here. They're on zone C. Let's go, teammates, right here. Down this hall. I'm actually going to go around this direction. I know it's long range, but I'm going to try to be as aggressive as I can. Oh, he's got a sword. Come at me with the sword. Come on. There's one down. We got Rampage. Let's push while we have Rampage. Go. Go as fast as you can. I don't think it lasts very long. No, it doesn't last that long. If it lasted longer, we'd be good to go. Right, we'll grab this. Grab this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I Had I killed that guy maybe one bullet quicker, we would have been totally fine there. That is crazy. Right, they're on all sides. The guy captured in B. There's two guys captured in B. I'm going to try to go around this direction on him. All right, they've capped zone B, but we have our arc strider. Here we go. There's one. Down this hall. Can I dodge it? Will I die? I'm gonna try it. <laughs> I got baited hardcore right there. Oh, the Titan smash. Too real. That always happens with Arc Strider. That's an old Destiny 1 throwback right there. I can't really blame the Huckleberry for not doing that well on this map because I feel like almost any SMG would have a hard time on this map. Well, we lost the first game, but I feel like that gave us some good experience with the Huckleberry. If we can get a smaller map, I really want to try to get that Rampage no, to proc. I would say we played well. We had a guy quit out, but a 2.09, a solid game with 23 opponents defeated, and it was really fun to start to use some of those weapons I'd never used before. Now, game number two is going to be the real test of the Huckleberry because I'm going to try to play and get a smaller map to see if we can really utilize the power of the SMG. All right, Pacifica. Now, this is a small map that we can utilize the power of the SMG. Okay, Huckleberry only. Let's see if we can try to utilize the Huckleberry until we run out of ammo. I'm not going to use the Pulse. I'm not going to use the Sniper. It's going to be Huckleberry only right off the bat. See how many kills we can get. Jumps right into the wall. Perfect place. So what you guys have come to expect on the channel is the perfect plays. All right, we got all the way behind them here. We might be able to do a little little flanking. They're not going to be ready for it. All right, I know you're over here. Come on. Come on. There we go. There's one down. We got the rampage. Where's the rest of them? All right, he's down the hall. Got to be as aggressive as possible and as quickly as possible. Right here. Come on, win that. There we go. Is there more back there? All right, is he going to push me, though? Oh, nice grenade. Well played grenade. I'm not even mad. All right, we're going for the We Ran Out of Metals, only using the Huckleberry right here. Huckleberry and abilities. Let's see if we can make it happen. Let's love that. There's a guy up high. I think he's got colony or rockets or something crazy on me. How do you have so much colony ammo? All right, that, yeah, I'm picking up the power ammo here, and I'm just not going to touch it because there is no reason they need to have it. Just makes things way harder for myself. Come on, dude. Don't. Don't. Oh, ho, ho. Gotcha. Nice try. Gave it to my teammates. That's a team player right there. All right. We got one kill. We're 19 away. There's a guy right here. What's this guy doing? There we go. The Huckleberry feels like the stability sometimes is just not there. Got credit for that one. Perfect. We're doing pretty well. I, I'm so tempted to pull out my sniper rifle right now. So tempted. All right. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Just one more bullet would have killed that guy. That's the problem is this gun. Look at the... That is not good. <laughs> for the exotic perk, for how good the exotic perk is, that does not feel good. I understand it's an SMG, but I just, I feel like it shouldn't be so shaky. I don't know. I could be wrong. I need to use it more. It's only been a game or two, so I haven't really gotten the power of the gun, but I feel like I really need to close the gap in order to make it happen here. There we go. Not bad. There's more back there. I'm going to close the gap here. Oh, there's two guys. I'm dead. I know it's only been a couple games with this, but I just feel like... Oh, that's a bad hammer, isn't it? Oh, that's not what you want to see. Uh-oh. Come on, Mike. Come on. Come on. Win the 1v1. There we go. All right, there's more guys in there. We got the Rampage perk, but I just... The problem is a lot of 1v2s. There's not much I can do on that. All right, we need to follow our teammate in. Uh-oh, he's dead. All right, let's... I got to push up on him. It's an SMG. I've got to be aggressive. Here we go. We got that guy down. Uh-oh, there's more coming in. Let me lob the nade. Try to shade step out of the way. I'm trying. I'm trying. There we go. We got quite a few right there. There's more around this corner. I'm going to try to push this way. See if I can stay alive right here. Come on. Push over the corner. I know he's up there. Where is he at? We're hunting him. There he is. Reload. There's more around here. We are making a little bit of a comeback here. It's a slow and painful process. I think they're all through this doorway. There's a guy right around this corner. Yep. Oh my, that would not have felt good. We have got to back up. Please back up. They are going to push me. We almost have our super, and we can push through that entire room with our super here. Yep. Once we get it, we're pushing through there. We are actually getting a ton of kills right now. All right, here we go. 
gains the lead. All right, there's one dude right over here. There he is. I did a little damage to him. He's right there. We got him. There we go. All right, I'm going to push across and try to use my super right here. There's one. Now, which way to go? Which way to go? I think I'm going to go up here. It's the safest option. This guy does not expect me. All right, that guy was not ready for me there. Let's shade over here. There we go. Shade out of the way. Shade out of the way. Not into the wall. Oh, my. We almost died right there. We're fine. We need to back up towards our teammates if we're going to survive, though, because they're starting to spawn on both sides. Things are not looking good here. This is very bad. There's a guy right around this corner. Right here. Come on, Mike. Get him. Get him. There we go. Very nice. More pushing me. Get ready for him. I am dead. I wish that I would have run away quicker, but I... I know you have colony. I don't... What are you doing with that gun? Stop it. Get some help. All right. Well, the we ran out of medals is not going to happen this game, but hopefully the second half of this game really... Oh my gosh. Have you ever tried to win a 1v4 in Destiny 2? It's called the impossible game. All right, there's one down. I don't think I can kill that guy from that range. It's just too shaky on him. Uh-oh, this might be the end. Well, the effort was really there, but with the time to kill, it's just not going to happen. A 1v3, mm, you gave it your best, Mike. All right, 10 seconds left. Let me grab a little sniper ammo here at the end. See if we can show off the Alone as a God Sniper just a tad. The Huckleberry, I think it just needs to be more stable and it would be very good. That's how I feel about it. I feel like it is a gun that could be extremely solid, but it's so shaky. The more I use it, I just feel like the shake on this weapon is crazy. Uh-oh. All right, push at me here. Uh-oh. I tried to hit him with the no scope. It didn't work. Yep, I think this might be the end of the game here, boys. We had a good run. The Huckleberry... Oh, it's a one point game. I'm not going to get there in time. Guys, I am slightly disappointed that we lost by one point. One point. So the Huckleberry, strong, very situational because the recoil on it can be unbearable at range. You just, what you need to do is pair it with a weapon that does well at medium to long range. If somebody pushes you and is up close, you can try to pop out the Huckleberry and try to mow them down and get that Rampage proc to perk. The problem that I'm having is that for the most part, 1v2 and 1v3 situations don't really happen that often in Destiny 2. The time to kill is so high that it's mostly team shots. So unless you're the one that's team shotting, if you're trying to do a 1v3, even with the rampage perk, you're not going to win that engagement. Not against good players. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Sub if you're new and you want to join the Geek Squad. Tomorrow, I'll be choosing the giveaway for the merch. Thank you guys for all the support recently. I'm super excited to announce the winner. All you got to do is leave a comment with the hashtag Bell Squad down below. Check out the merch if you haven't. Link down in the description. We've been selling a ton of it recently. You guys have seemed to really enjoy it. I think the most popular item so far is the Otaku Geek. But all of them have been selling really well. So thank you guys for all the support. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Hope you enjoyed the video. I will see you in tomorrow's. Thanks for watching. Peace. Mm -hmm.